Congress, meanwhile, pushing a new bill to limit refugees coming into the U.S. until tighter security screenings are in place. The Senate is debating it now, the House approving it earlier. After the vote, Arizona Congresswoman Kirsten Sinema releasing a statement saying the Islamic State is a legitimate immediate threat to the U.S., Congress, and the administration. They have a duty to keep our country safe from terrorism, and this legislation provides an added level of security to our robust refugee vetting process. Back here in Arizona, state and county leaders also calling for a complete stop of Syrian refugees being allowed into Arizona until those security screens are in place. And the county attorney not just taking a stand, but taking a shot at the president himself. ABC 15's Mary Ellen Resendez is joining us. And Mary Ellen, County Attorney Bill Montgomery is not holding back on this issue. No, Katie, he's not. And while he still, he says his stance is not political, some might disagree. Any responsible president would pause and take the necessary steps to work with governors across this country instead of gauging in the rather uh, petulant and immature criticism of political opponents. Montgomery says he's backing Governor Doug Ducey's call to stop the flow of Syrian refugees to Arizona until Congress can put into place stronger security screens. Now, Montgomery says Arizona has been known to be home for extremists in the past. He is questioning if the president is taking enough precautions to make sure ISIS militants aren't getting into Arizona. For heaven's sakes, this president's language against fellow Americans is more strident in tone than the tone he ever uses when we're talking about people who actually represent a direct threat to American lives. Now, that being said, Montgomery also pointed out that not all Syrian refugees are insurgents. Katie?